This bill is very personal to me. Um, it's a tragedy that to this very day I find to be incomprehensible. Uh, daughter of actually one of our Middlesex County prosecutors, Chris Cooperite, who he and his wife are just terrific people. The one uh, daughter was getting on the bus, the other little toddler, a two-year-old, follows her. The little girl is standing in front of the bus. The arm goes out. She was so little that she was underneath the arm, and the bus driver rode over her. It was, and then Chris being a um, prosecutor actually responded to the scene. She was so little that the bus driver didn't even know he did it. Uh, two stops later, the police actually stopped the bus, took everybody off, and the poor bus driver had a nervous breakdown as a result. It's just a tragedy on so many levels. Abigail's law is very simple. It just basically would require school buses to have sensors. So school bus drivers would know when there is a child in front or behind the school bus. It's just basically an added uh, safety mechanism just to ensure the safety of the child. This tragedy occurred in 2003. And it's beyond frustration that this still isn't the law of the state of New Jersey. This is not pie in the sky technology. I'm sure that every person's car has this exact technology in it right now. And it's my hope, my prayer in this particular case. We get this through, get it on the governor's desk, and, and let's, let's do what's right. First of all, in memory of uh, poor Abigail and, and, and to give her parents some kind of comfort. And also, most importantly, to make sure it never happens again.